Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com and I'm currently on board Ponant's beautiful Le Champlain, one of their Explorer class mega yacht ships. So right now I'm in a deluxe stateroom, which is the entry level stateroom on board. These ships are made for long-term cruising. And so you can see that even in a room this size, it's perfect for an extended cruise. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So right when you walk in, right on the left, you're gonna have the, uh, the toilet. I really appreciate having the toilet separate from the rest of the bathroom. I just think it's a very, very positive thing, okay? And then as you come in here, you're gonna have your storage on the right, okay? I'm gonna open that up for you. You've got two very plush robes, of course. You've got your slippers, your umbrella down there as well. Okay. And then you also notice there's a there's a mat down there because a lot of times when you're coming in from an expedition, you might have mud or dirt on your shoes, something like that. So it's just a nice place to, uh, to put that. You've got storage all the way up and down here as well. Hair dryer that's complimentary in every stateroom, of course. Okay. And then a tiny bit of storage up here, but that's where you're going to have your uh, life jackets. Okay. So a little more storage over here, but really this is your, uh, your mini bar setup. So you've got a great Nespresso maker here. Nespresso uh, is included. And then of course you can have it, um, you can have it refreshed as often as you like from uh, your cat stateroom attendant. You have the Nespresso or espresso cups up there. And then down here, you're going to have your fully stocked mini fridge. And then the safe, which I love, is big enough for a uh, for a laptop, but also there's a plug inside the safe, so it's perfect if you want to use like a USB splitter and charge a couple devices. Put them in there, lock them up, keep them nice and safe. All right. Okay. And then I'm going to take you into the bathroom. Okay. So there's a couple features that I really love about this. So the first one is the shower is it's pretty big for a mega yacht, especially for an entry level stateroom. So I'm six six, but I can still move around in here pretty well. You've got the, the shower that, of course, you can go up and uh, move around as you need. All right, let's go in there. And then one of the things that I really, really appreciate here is that they put the sink up top, which allows you to have a great drawer there so you can have storage where you put things away completely. I really, really appreciate that on a cruise ship, and not a lot of cruise ships have the ability to do that. A little more storage here. You get your magnifying mirror, a plug uh, for your razor if you need it, and then also a backlit mirror here as well. And let me show you one interesting, slightly funky feature, especially if you're traveling with a friend. So the idea behind this is to open it up and have a lot of light. So when you open that up, you get a lot of light in here, but you can also see anybody in the shower. So since I'm cruising with a good friend of mine right now, I'm gonna say goodbye and keep that shut throughout the entire cruise. All right, so now let's head on in. Okay, so this is the, the main bedroom area. You've got a little bit of storage here on the side of the nightstand. You've got your USB plug. You also have a Euro plug there as well. Reading light that can turn on and off and these really cool lights that light up the beautiful artwork on the wall. You've got your, your pillows and then the bed, of course. Uh, but keep in mind that if you want it a little bit softer or harder, just talk to your stateroom attendant. They'll be happy to uh, work with you on that. And I always get a couple extra pillows myself because um, I really, uh, I like that, especially if I'm reading in bed. Okay, so over here, you're gonna have more storage. So it's identical on both sides. You've got a drawer here and here. Okay, and then as you open this up, you've got four little cubbies on either side. So you've got eight cubbies between the two here. Okay, right here, you've got your passenger services guide, everything that you need to know about the ship, um, and then some brochures for your future cruises to Antarctica. I'm sure you're gonna love and go on as well. Uh, complimentary bottled water here, um, and then you've got uh, opener for wine. Always need that, especially on a French cruise ship. You've got this great little couch area here. I, I think it really adds to the room and it's a great use of space. You've got a little table here as well. Um, so for me, this is a great place to have a cup of coffee in the morning, though you're probably gonna wanna have it out on the balcony. I'll show you what I'm talking about in a second, but let me finish uh, showing you the room. So over here, you've got a nice little area to get ready. Um, you've got a, a backlit uh, makeup mirror here. And then you also have your, uh, your Bose speaker, which is complimentary and standard in all staterooms on board the ship. You've got a Euro plug and then also a US plug. And then this nice little light here that, that I think uh, just you know, helps if you're getting ready. And a little bit more storage and a great seat to sit in. So now let's head out onto the balcony, which really sets this apart from a lot of the other staterooms on board. And let me show you what I'm talking about. So one thing that's super unique about this specific room is it's on a lower level. So on a mega yacht like this, security is a big uh, big thing that you always have to pay attention to. So this room actually locks to give you a, a key. Uh, you lock it from the inside so that you can keep it locked when you are in port or you know if you're not utilizing it. Um, but as you head out here, let me put my sunglasses on, okay? 
Um, you can see that this is it's the same size balcony as the other staterooms, but what's different is that this is solid metal. Once again, this is a safety and security feature because it's on a lower deck. Um, so maybe the average person who's sitting here may not be able to look straight out. I'm 6'6", six, six. I have no problem looking out. Um, but uh, you know, this is the lead-in room for the entire ship, uh, lowest cost, and that's one of the reasons for it. But I find that a lot of my customers really do like this category of room. So when you're ready to book this stateroom, any of the suites on board this ship, or any in the Ponant fleet, reach out to Hard Travel. We are your Ponant experts. We have a phenomenal relationship with them. So we can make sure that you get the absolute most out of your time and your money and have the exploration experience of a lifetime.